Hi everyone! Welcome back to my channel. Laura here with another Dollar Tree haul. Um, it's a mixed match of things, but most of it is brand new to my store. And some are repeats that my family and I like. So let me get started. If you're new, uh, stopping by my channel for the first time, welcome as well, and I hope you stick around. The first thing I want to get started with is food. They had Hamburger Helper Philly Cheese Steak at the Dollar Tree. Now, I know you could probably get this at, for a dollar, you know, at the market, but it's at the Dollar Tree, so why not? I'm there all the time anyway. <laughs> so, we've never tried the Philly Steak, so I'm excited to try that. And then from Betty Crocker, I had not even seen these inside the store. It says limited edition Yukon Gold Casserole includes breadcrumb herb topping. So that looked yummy. So we're going to give that a try. And then they also had the sweet potato casserole includes streusel topping. So that sounds really good. A blend of real russet and sweet potatoes with seasonings and sweet streusel topping. So yeah, I did get two of each of those, I think, somewhere in the mess behind me. <laughs> um, let's see, where else do I, I picked up just a repeat, the traditional hunt spaghetti sauce. I like to keep that on hand. And this was new. I've never seen this in the markets either. Let me see who this is distributed by. Ola Nola Foods. Okay, and it's got the, it's uh, potato chips, chili, and lemon, or lime. That looked interesting. And then there's this one, and it has a little seasoning packet in there. Uh, salsa packet and these are potato chips with salsa packet so yeah I thought that was interesting we're gonna give those a try okay so I found the other box of the Yukon gold casserole I knew I bought two <laughs> and let's see my mom wanted some chicken crackers I've never tried these um, her and my son love the chicken crackers and then they had the George and Tom's sugar cones. You get 12 in here. Let me see who distributes these. Contains a bioengineered food ingredient. Ooh, that doesn't sound good. Uh, it's a Safety Pacific Cone Company. Okay, so it's not a green briar. So I did pick up that. I picked up some sprinkles. My, my grandson and I will be doing a Bake With Us video. We'll film it tomorrow. I don't know when I'll get it up, but that's going to be fun. He's a character. You all will love him. <laughs> and then, then my son got some Bunch of Crunch mini little candies and then repeat by i picked up two of the pineapple it's really funny when i first tried the pineapple of this hint water it was okay it was it was like okay i can drink it the one i didn't like was the the blackberry the raspberry there or something like that i didn't care for that one but the more i drink the pineapple one it's growing on me and i i tend to gravitate gravitate <laughs> I tend to gravitate towards it so I did pick up two pineapples and one two three four of the watermelon the watermelon is my absolute favorite and I it just helps me to drink more water during the day okay and oh my gosh look at this I even I even uh, yelled oh my goodness when I was at the store I kind of embarrassed myself <laughs> the man behind me just looked at me like lady you need to get out more <laughs> but they had the Betty Cracker Betty Cracker I cannot talk today I'm telling you 
Betty Crocker Apple Brown Sugar Cookie Mix. And it's a full size. It's a 17.5 ounce bag. I mean, it's really heavy. So yeah, we might make these tomorrow along with our cupcakes. We'll have to see, because these look yummy. And I want to do some baking before it gets to be 115 degrees outside. <laughs> Another repeat buy. I love these oatmeal. The Outrageous Quick One Minute Oats. I absolutely love it. These are by Monarch LLC in New Jersey. And I these I recommend these. These, these are really good. Really good. Can't even find my words today, I'm telling you. And then this is new at my Dollar Tree. They're called Ball Rich. Am I saying that right? Ball Ricks. A tough touch of salt and their sweet potato chips. Yeah. I've never tried these. I'm gonna try them right now for you guys because I'm really hungry. Maybe that's why I can't talk. Let's see. Show you what they look like. Well, that's not a very cute one. Let me find a cute one, cuter one. This is kind of what they look like. There. Mmm. Mmm. Those are really good. A lot of the times when I get sweet potato chips, they're really hard to chew. And I don't have the greatest teeth. Those are not. They're nice and... You're, I'm able to, to chew them. I mean, they're not like a regular potato chip. They're a little thicker. Really, really good. I might have to go back and get some more of those. Those are really, really good. Okay. And it's not just because I'm hungry. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to move on to the kitchen department or the Tupperware department. I found these sure fresh. A, a vented lid and these are 9.54 cups container I thought that was interesting because a lot of times I want to put my food up you know and get my dishes washed and I have to leave the lid you know I, I kind of leave the lid like that and let the the steam out so this way I can just you know go ahead and cover it up so I thought that was real interesting so I got one of those and then they had this size. Hopefully you can see that. So they got this size. This is a 9.7 ounce. Let me back you up. There we go. And then this is a two pack of the 3.78 cup. So that's what that looks like. So yeah. And then they had this real pretty mint green take along. Uh, these are what? Uh, 2.9 cups. Isn't that pretty? I love that color. It's the color of my craft room. Okay, moving on to the boring stuff I picked up. I just picked up two black hangers. These are okay hangers. You only get seven, but for a dollar, because at Walmart, uh, at my Walmart anyway, they have raised their hangers up to, I think it's $1.57 now. Okay, moving on to the canvases. Look how pretty. They had so many new canvases out, and these are by Main Street, and these are distributed by Chartwell Studio Incorporated. Look how pretty that is. It says love on there, like in a gold foil. So pretty. And then I pick this one up. And if I don't use them, you know, for groceries and whatnot, I can always use these as gift bags. And then they can use the totes themselves. So I picked up two of those. And then, let's see. Okay, I'm back. I had cleared my table so you can get a better look. I wanted you to see these canvases better. So there they are. Aren't those beautiful? So sticking with bags, I'm gonna move on to the party section or the, um, what are they calling this? Let's see. Where's the tags on these? 
so these are in the uh, Wola section. They have them out in the front. I think they're for like Mother's Day. Look how pretty that bag is. I was grabbing like one of each. I finally had to stop. There's a, so many more. I wish I could take pictures for you guys, um, but not at this store. So there's what that one looks like. I think this is probably my favorite. It's got the polka dots with the little flower on it. I just love that. And then this one with the, I'm all tangled up. This one with the yellow flowers and the blue. I feel like I've seen something like this from the Dollar Tree before. Um, comment down below if you have seen that yet. Uh, look at the, motor, the motorcycle. It, today, I'm tongue-tied. I'm telling you, I don't know what's going on with me, but it's it's just, uh, I don't know. <laughs> just look at the bicycle. <laughs> Isn't that pretty? With the balloons and the flowers. So, it's glittered on one side, and then it's not on the other. And let's see. That's the way they all are. So, they got glitter on one side. Except for this one. There's no glitter. Or is there? Oh, I lied. Little polka dots are glittered, but it's not a lot. Maybe that's why it's my favorite. So there's that one front and then the back. Let's see what the, so the sides look like that on this one. Yeah, nothing big in the sides. They're the same print on all of them. Let's see what the bicycle has. So the bicycle has these flowers on the inside. So that's pretty. Okay. And then look at this with the flower pot. Isn't that pretty? And it's got this side with no glitter with the butterfly. And then the inside. Aw, it's got little butterflies. How cute. Every time I see butterflies now, I'm reminded uh, of my cousin, Thingcha. So here is this one. This one's pretty too. This is probably my second favorite. And that's what it looks like on the inside. And then there's, oh, this is a, this a repeat? Oh, I got two of these. That has a sunflower with the butterfly on it. And on the inside of this one, now I got glitter on me. It's got the butterfly there, the flowers. So, so pretty. Like I said, I was just like grabbing, grabbing, grabbing. I had to like say, okay, you can't get them all. Just uh, take what's in your cart and, and move on. <laughs> so I did pick those up. And then um, at the registers, they had these beautiful journals, inspirational journals, 100 pages. This says, Stop Doubting and Believe, John 20, 27. And... This is what this one looks like. It's got the flowers. So that's the floral one. This one, uh, well, it's got, the, it's got the paper on it. I don't want to open it because these will be for um, gifts. It says, kind words are like honey. That's what it says. Proverbs 16, 24. Not pretty. Sorry for the glare. Kind of that watercolor texture or color in you and then this one says grow in grace 2 peter 3 18 and it's got the feathers on it okay <laughs> and then this one has arrows on it this is probably my favorite uh Well, I really wish that wasn't there. I'm going to open this one because I'm probably going to keep this one. So let me see what this says on there. This says, perhaps this is the moment for which you are created. Es Esther 4.14. So yeah. Oh, the pages have this beautiful print on the inside. Can you guys see that? Oh my goodness, that's beautiful. So I guess you would put, you know, your topic here or whatever. And it has the same scripture. 
Oh no, it's got different scriptures. Let me see. No, it's got the same. No, it's got different scriptures, but for the most part, it's this scripture. But there is, um, they threw in different, like this one is stop doubting and believe, John 20, 27. Um, so yeah, nice, really, really nice. That That's a, I mean, look at, I, am I too close to the camera? There you go. I don't know if, can you see the, there we go. Isn't that pretty? There's that one, the print. I love that. I love, love, love that. Yeah, so those will probably be some, some uh, Christmas gifts. And let's see, moving on. Oh no, I'm gonna have to take this one back. I got a chipper. I got these little candle stands, but look, this one's got a big old gash in it. So yeah, I'm gonna return this one. But I did pick up three because I thought, look, I could maybe make something like that. You know, I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. It doesn't look as good as it did in the store. <laughs> okay. Sticking with the voila section, look at these beautiful bows. Aren't those beautiful? This is the mint green, and I got like a dusty pink one. So, so pretty. And let's see, in the teacher's corner section, I just picked up this by Crayola, Desktop for Kids, and I thought I can use these little tags for something crafting. So yeah, pick that up. They had the paint with water, they had the Paw Patrol and the SpongeBob. I picked up two Paw Patrol. This will be fun. I got the boys come in for a couple days. Uh, tonight, actually, starting. <laughs> and then in the garden section, I found the um, hexagon planters. thought these were really pretty. I'll probably paint them, but I thought that was really cute. Let's see. Got a picture there. Can you see that? How's that? That better <laughs> like that and then in health and beauty i picked up they had the by global beauty care they had the moisturizing foot treatment mask so i did get that one and let me read it for you that's uh softens crack heels and rough dry feet moisturizes exfoliates Convenient wearable mask socks. So I did pick up two of these because boy do my feet need them. Then they had this one, exfoliating foot treatment mask. Peels away calluses and dead skin cells. Softens cracked heels and rough dry feet. Convenient wearable mask socks. That up. Got some... Honey lemon cough drops for mom. I knew I got two. I got two of one of them. I knew that. <laughs> and then I saw this one. I didn't have my glasses on, so I didn't even know what, what I was getting. But it's the Rosy and Ready Facial Serum Rose Hip and Evening Primrose. So I did pick that up. Yep. It looked interesting. And then they had the multivitamin. I think I've gotten this before. Never tried it. But a lot of this stuff I put, I save for Christmas baskets at the end of the year. And let's see. Picked up this tattoo stamp pin. I thought that was so cute. And I thought, you know, I don't have to use this on my skin because I probably won't. But... I could probably use it like, you know, crafting. So let me see if I can get it out of the box. It's just not my day today. <laughs> there we go. I'll show you what it looks like. So it's got that little end there. And then, oh, cute. 
You know what I should do is I should put one on and because I don't have no tattoos, nothing against them. I just not, I'm not into pain. Okay. I'm not going to purposely go put myself in pain because I have enough of that. <laughs> so, but I tease my kids all the time. You know what I should do is I should stamp myself up and tell them I got a tattoo. That would be hilarious. They would probably get mad at me because the, the girls are like, let's get a matching tattoo. Yeah, no, nope. Not unless it's a rub on <laughs> or a stamp. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, I, I'm digressing. Uh, I picked up the Jergens Original Scent Cherry Almond. I love the way this smells. I was surprised to see that at the Dollar Tree. And last section is the pet section. And then I'm going to show you some repeats that I have gotten. So I did pick up this brush. The My animals are shedding so bad let's see now with new design pet brush so it's just got like the soft bristles on this side and then the regular bristles on that side i picked up this th these thinning shears and i didn't pick these up for the dogs i thought well why can't i use it let's see how they cut because <laughs> those are kind of expensive and then i did pick up the what are they calling this just a pet brush, but I, this is the type I normally use to get the hair off. So pick that up. You'll be able to see. And it's a really pretty color. I like that. And then I picked up dog grooming mitt. Thought we can get some hair off of that. It's got the cute little, oh, got this on this side, microfiber on that side. Then the little paw prints. So yeah, that was it for my regular Dollar Tree haul. So... Now I want to share some other items that I picked up. Um, I will probably do a 500 subscriber giveaway and the giveaway will be the fairy garden figurines. So I've got the palm trees with the little bird on the wooden pole there. So there will be that one. There will be this one. There'll be this one, the little gnomies ready to go swimming, <laughs> and let's see, is that it? Oh, got two of those, so that won't be in there. <laughs> and then, sorry for the noise, whoop, just kicking you guys everywhere, I'm telling you. Just, it's just been a day. So I did get one of these. This will be in the giveaway. One of these shell houses will be in the giveaway. Another house. So those of you that can't find most of this fairy garden beach theme items, I will be posting a 500 sub giveaway. I'm almost there. So please like and share. It'll help my channel to grow. I would surely appreciate it. Honestly, I didn't even think I would get past, you know, 30 uh, subscribers. Honestly, I'm so blessed. I feel so blessed to be able to, um, get as far as I did when I'm going to be honest when I first opened up my channel I thought you know oh I'm going to get you know all these subscribers and I'm going to have this big audience but sorry about that I had to get the door <laughs> anyway what I was saying is when I first started my channel I um I started off just doing nothing but crafting and and whatnot and um, I get most of my supplies at the Dollar Tree and I enjoy watching Dollar Tree hauls. So I thought, you know what, why not do hauls on my channel? Because I like to see what other people get and what's, and the Dollar Trees are not all the same as well as the Dollar General. Um, people get things that we never get. We get things that, that they never get. It's just the way it is. So I enjoy watching it. So I thought, you know what, I'm going to, uh, also, uh, put that content on my my videos. So 
I know I'm rambling, but I just wanted to explain that when I first started my channel, I thought it was instant because, you know, the web is so big, you would think that, you know, but it's not, it's not, it, um, it's a lot of work. I do enjoy it. It's more work that I anticipated. Um, and I must say that I am contemplating, um, giving up my channel for a while because my mom does live with me now. She does have, um, uh, mid to severe dementia and it's taking up a lot more of my time. So I'm trying to juggle between, you know, that that's why you haven't seen a whole lot of crafting on my channel. I'm trying to, I have a lot of ideas and if you want to stick with me and if I do keep my channel, I so, so appreciate you all sticking with me. It's a battle, but I'm, I'm, I'm willing to be in it for the long haul, but you know, I need subscribers. So, um, yeah, if you can comment, like, and share on my channel, I would so, so appreciate it. And let me get to 500 so I can do a giveaway. The fairy garden will not, will not be the only things in the giveaway. And I will try to, um, get more items, hopefully the whole set, um, by the time I do host the giveaway. So anyway... Thank you all for watching and listening and taking time out of your day. I love every one of you, um, friends and family both. So with that said, I will talk to y'all next time. Bye.